This Raw Vision video is brought to you by Metro Solar, proud partner of the Richmond Football Club. like Richmond has been it's been an honour. Um, seeing some you know, pretty uh, famous players like Jack Revolt, Dustin Martin, Brett Delidio, it's been pretty pretty awestruck by it. But um, yeah I've loved it every every day here. Yeah I, I love being here. It was something that I you know worked hard for that year so it was something that I really really wanted and just based on um, like interviews and stuff I thought my chances were were, were reasonable. Um, and yeah, to, to get picked was, you know, it was just an amazing feeling and uh, it's just, yeah, it's probably my best life achievement to date. I was at my friend's house, um, so he's a, he's a keen Richmond supporter and so were a lot of my friends. Uh, so I was at his house and yeah, once I got my name read out, everyone sort of went, went crazy a bit and I was very emotional and yeah, it was a great feeling. I think running is the key one for me, um, being a big guy. Um, and in today's football, you know, getting up and down the ground is just a key part of the game. So um, that's just been my number one goal to improve and I uh, try and do as many extras as I can to improve it and uh, yeah, just chipping away at it every day to get it better. In plays in particular, I work with Jack quite a bit. Jack's very knowledgeable, he knows the game. He's, an amazing, he's a smart player. So I try and um, learn off him a lot. Greg Mello, uh, our forward line coach, he's a great teacher. He helps me a lot. Uh, Max Bailey, uh, really good at yeah, telling me, um, you know, what I should do and stuff. And yeah, those have been those have been really good help. The older boys have been very welcoming. Um, um, it's it is hard at times with the age gap, but they really do make an effort to um, to talk to you, say hello, say good day, um, have a chat. Uh, it's really it's uh, hats off to them because it's. Um, you don't have to do it, but they make an effort to do it, which is, which is really, I really respect that. It is nice to have um, some of my Knights teammates. Um, obviously, went through um, football with them last year and to now be at an AFL club with them as well. To see how far they've come as well, is, it's really good. And, um, you know, to see some familiar faces every day, it's, um, yeah, it's something I really enjoy. Juggling basketball and footy was pretty hectic as a kid. Uh, basketball, you can, you, know, you can get in the... I guess the, the trap of playing for a lot of teams and doing four to five training sessions a week um, before before school, playing up to like two games, is, and being a, such a an avid sportsman, you know, you, you want to play basketball and football, and you just want to try and juggle them. So as a kid, it's a bit easier because it's not as hard on your body, but as you get older, it just gets harder and harder. And yeah, eventually just got to the stage where football was just the, the sport I wanted to pursue in the end. And, yeah, it's um, paid off. I guess my goals for this year would be um, get my body into a uh, to a level that's um, to, at a, a good endurance base. Uh, I'd like to get a, a lot lighter, uh, as well as retaining my strength, um, learning all the structures and all that. I think that would be a, a key thing to, uh, to get out of this year, and to just just keep putting my hand up for selection. Really, just yeah. So. That makes the other boys better as well. So yeah, that'll be my goals.